We're going to begin, though, with chaos inside a Coney Island as twin brothers stand charged with shooting a bystander during an argument over fried mushrooms. Today in court, the man who was shot in that argument took the stand and detailed what he says happened. 61-year-old brothers Dwight and Dwayne Samuels face charges, including assault with intent to murder in this incident. This was back on June 19th at Nikki D's Coney Island. Rod Maloney, live at the restaurant where this happened, which is on West 7 Mile, headed to trial, Rod. Yeah, it's bizarre, Devin, because let's consider this. Nikki D's, a popular local chain, very busy place, and it's not so much about the mushrooms anymore in this case because it turns out that the people who were disappointed in not having the mushrooms didn't take their anger out on the restaurant or anybody who works for the restaurant. It was some poor guy sitting there just waiting for an order. Today's prelim for 61-year-old twin brothers Dwight and Dwayne Samuels revealed a lot. They'd been celebrating their birthday. We're not showing the victim's face or giving his identity, but high-definition security cameras captured the entire incident in the early morning hours of June 19th. The shooting victim is the guy sitting at the counter. We heard his testimony today. And while waiting for his order, a man and woman came in asking for fried mushrooms. And while other Nikki D's sell them, this one does not. And the victim said it disappointed the woman when she found out from Dwight Samuels. He told her that they don't sell fried mushrooms. Did it appear to you that the defendant was angry at the fact that they didn't sell fried mushrooms? Yes. They left. About 20 minutes later, the man the victim identified as Dwight Samuels returned with his brother, and they immediately showed a violent streak, scuffling. One of the brothers brandishing a pipe hits another customer. He runs away, then pulls a gun on the man at the counter. I was holding my hands up. And, uh, hoping that he don't shoot me. He wasn't so lucky. The victim says the brothers beat him with a pipe. The video shows that. They pushed him onto the floor. And while we won't show it. When the bullet hit, it knocked all my teeth out. Bullet went through his mouth, sad to say. He is going to apparently be okay. But in the meantime, there is a raft of charges here, like we said, uh, felony firearms, attempted murder, and also habitual offender. That trial is likely to go later this year. Back to you. Well, Rod, as you said, it really doesn't, it no longer seems to be between the defendants and the restaurant. So do we have it figured out exactly how all this started? Well, they did ask the victim what it was that he understood about the two brothers while he was lying there on the floor, and he said that he smelled alcohol, a lot of alcohol, and he believed that that may be at the heart of all of what can yeah. only be called bizarre behavior. It wouldn't be surprising. All right, Rod.